Hello everybody, it's me. Well, who the fuck else can it be? <laughs> um, I wasn't going to do any more hauls, not on Thursday, but I've been out the day. So, if you can guess, today is Wednesday. Um, and I'm going to ask them, so I will be doing the haul, but I'm going to post that up at the weekend. Oh, my mouth's drier than fucking Satan's arsehole or whatever. I've been to Kinky Park today, and I've just visited a couple of shops. And when I say Kinky Park, there's no women walking around with sussies on in, fish nets and cracking whips. It's up that kind of kinky. You know, it's King, short for Kingston. It's for Kingston Park. Anyway, I've been to Kinky, kinky Park, um, popped into like Tesco's and Home Bargains, and I popped into TK Maxx. So I'm going to do a little mini haul. So I will be posting this tomorrow, which is Thursday. And then the one from Asda, I will probably post on Saturday. Because as you all know, I'm going on my little, my little mini holly bobs on Monday. I'm going to uh, Centre Park, so by Penrith. So I might take some like video stuff of when I'm there. I don't know how to edit it, so it will probably be shite. Um, like I say, I've been with my sister all day, been at Kinky Park, then she went to hers, and she's means a fantastic, like, roast dinner. She just makes the most fantastic things. She's a great cook, my sister. And it's what we do on a Wednesday. It's our day. We go do a bit shopping. I go back to her, she cooks us something. Sorry about this, but my mouth's so dry. It's a medication, it makes my mouth dry. And oh, it's awful. Um, so, went to hers. See, because I can't cook. You know, I can I do certain things well. But then I try and cook something that I've seen and it doesn't look like it. And I don't think it tastes like it either. You know, I mean, it looks like something that's been picked out of Satan's nose. It's like, Looks really awful. <laughs> really bad. Um have up to anything else. No, that's it. That's the week so far. Babysitting tomorrow. Um Babysitting tomorrow. As down in the morning, then babysitting. So be rushing around a bit late. Um I've made my appointment for my doctors and all that. All that's done. I need to make an appointment for my dentist, as you know. I've got to have the five teeth out. So I'm dreading that, but I'm not going to get that done till after I've come back from my holly bobs. And my skull cup has me in the parents. <coughs> this is one of my favourite cups, and I've got a pair of my favourite earrings in. Earrings of the die! There you go, it's me parrot earrings. Look at them. Lovely, aren't they? Birdies. I've got quite a few pairs of bird earrings. Anyway, I'm going to get on with the haul because, like I say, it's just a couple of bits. This is going to be a quite a short video for me. It's And it's I'm going to post it tomorrow. And I am going to post the one from tomorrow on Saturday. Right, let's get on with the haul. Um, I went to Tesco's first. I didn't get much, so it didn't come to much. Um, I got... A big bottle of Robinson's Double Strength Apple and Black Currant. That was two pound. So if you got, it normally three pounds something, but if you got the card, if you got your thingy card, it's two pound. I've got two of these Naked Noodle Katsu Katsu Curry Pot Racers. These are really nice. And if it's on Slim World, I think we're like one and a half cents each. So they're good for a quick grab and go lunch. And these are normally one twenty five, but if you've got your card, it's two pound. No, sorry, it's seventy p. I think it was with a card. So that's that. Um, I got some fridge readers. These were two pound sixty, but I got them for one sixty with my club card, and you get five packs. Well, normally it's one sixty for three little packs. So they're for your grandson at the weekend. Oh, else I've got in here. Yes, these were two twenty-five. I love crispy seaweed thins. 
love them and they're so hard to get in the shops i can never find them so i've grabbed myself a couple of boxes i'm going to take one away with us next week and want to keep here and these are like what a sin for a pack not like the full pack of this but you know like for one of the little packs they're a sin and they're really nice and they're lovely like you know what i like these in you know when you're making like a tuna sandwich or something like that scrumpling into some tuna it's really nice and the last thing i got from tesco's was some couscous for one pound twenty and that lot comes about eleven pound didn't come to much couscous is getting really expensive this used to be like 80 odd p it's now one pound twenty and more one pound sixty i think i paid for that I see things are getting more expensive. What can you do? It's what it, it is. What it is. Got me coffee. Um, right. Uh, into home bargains. Right, I see. They're not very exciting. I didn't get much. Um, I got some of these dish matics. These were two pound eighty nine for eight. So I I use my dish matic all the time. I love it. I wouldn't be without it. That's some dish matic. Um, these were 99 p for some spectacle and lens wipes. I use these for my tablet, for me, me readers, things like that. So they're always handy to have in. So I got three packs of peanut butter skinny crunch. These are my favourite of them all. Plus the 99p normally like one pound fifteen or something in Asda, so I thought I'd get a few things. I will probably get some from Asda just to keep stocked up. Um what else? Uh, I got a little bottle of this a uh, sugar-free toffee caramel flavour for your coffee. And it's a pound. And I sometimes buy the big bottles, but I never ever use it all. So it goes up the way, so I thought I'll just buy a little bottle. That was a pound. Um, a denture box. This is why I put my dentures in the soak overnight. But my old one, the hinge had snapped here at the back, so I need a new one. This was like eight nine p, so they're not expensive. Six nine p for a new pastry brush. It looks bent, but I think it's supposed to be like that. I've got like the nylon bristle one. I don't like use it because I think it's a bit like ugh, tacky. So I got a new one of them. Uh, one pound seventy nine for some more of me mouthwash. You just know I always pick this stuff up. I've got about ten bottles in the cupboard. Honestly, it's getting serious. Uh, one pound thirty five for two bars of Dove. I've got some somewhere, but I can't find it, so I need to get some more. Um, I think these were three twenty five for some Febreze. These, you know, for that year air fresheners. I like these ones. That was that. Um, one twenty five for some polos. I need my polos. I've been having them on empty of polos, so I brought some polos. Yeah, one twenty five. And the last thing was one twenty five, and that is a pot of gear. Like fat free, high protein, natural Icelandic yogurt. I've got the flavour drops from my protein. Put them into that. This this will be for me breakfast in the morning. This will do like two, three breakfasts or a snack tomorrow night. I mix it up, mix it up with some fruit and scrumble one of them skinny crunch on. It's really nice. Um I did go to take max, I only picked one thing up. And this is this picture, it was £15. The price is upside down on it, but I just thought it's going to go nice in, in my flat when I get poor pictures. I'm doing like um, odd pictures, I'm not having like, it's not going to be the same, it's going to be more modern print with some like sort of vintage and more vintage prints and some diamond paintings and I've got this thing I collect old brooches like vintage brooches 
and I've got a frame and it's got a pallet in it, like a pallet panel. There's no glass and I'm going to put some velvet on and pin them all into it so make like a display of that. So it's going to be things, it's going to have like photos and things like that. It'll be, I've got a plan, put it that way. There's a plan in this like fucking noggin of mine, honestly. Um, and the last thing is I came in and as in Amazon had been, well, I bought a tray bag from as or from a uh, Tesco's before the Christmas and I'd hide my Christmas tree box out. Well, I went to open this fucking tree bag and put my tree in. I swear down, you could have camped five people and their dogs in this tree bag. It was absolutely massive. I've had to put my tree in it because I, like I see, I hide the, the tree box out. Honestly, if you'd seen the size of this thing, don't know what kind of tree it was for but it wasn't for a seven foot tree so i bought one from amazon and this was six pound no about six pound but i bought some less but won't be here tomorrow and it come to 11 pound and i got off there when i paid for it and it only come to eight pound something it all seems to happen with me that i always seem to get money knocked off i don't know why but that's a tree storage bag and it should fit the seven foot tree. So that is my haul. It is all finished. That was a little fast haul. Um, like I say, I'm going to ask the tomorrow. I won't post that on Saturday. And for the rest of the week, I'm doing fuck all. Well, I am going to be potting around. I've still got loads of boxes to unpack. So I'm going to unpack some boxes. Um do some bits and bobs, hang me new curtains and just try and get this friggin' flat done. Anyway, that's me finished and you know what I'm going to say? You know what I'm going to say? Be good, be kind, but most of all, be excellent to each other and you know what? Just be a nice human. Bye!